now to a harrowing story of survival in Tehama County. A Bay Area fisherman stranded in the wilderness with some serious injuries, finally found alive after lying near a creek for two days. CBS 13's Marley Ginter with how he managed to survive. So now I'm seriously back in it. A leisurely fishing trip turned out to be anything but. And it was constantly getting snagged in vines and I'm my arms are all scraped from bushes and trees, and it wound up being a grueling walk, and I actually fell five or six times. 66-year-old Bob Bellon took a tumble some 75 feet down an embankment, dislocating his knee and not able to call for help. I had my cell phone in a waterproof bag, and I sat there just crying while I was staring at no service in the middle of all this misery. It's an area he's been in before, near Highway 32 and Dum Deer Road in Tehama County, near the Butte County line. At one point, he fell backwards, hitting his head on a rock without anything to stop the bleeding. So I wound up cleaning it up as best as I could. When I got it dry, I had some crazy glue in my fly fishing nets, and I actually sealed the head injury up with crazy glue. But by day three, he started hallucinating. With no more food to eat, his blood sugar dropped dangerously low. Would have been eating caddis larva, <laughs> fresh out of the river. I'm glad they got me just before dinner. Butte County Sheriff's detectives, with the help of Cal Fire and Butte EMS, found Ballon. And on that long haul back to the ambulance, it's clear he made some friends. They came down the river, and I was waving my shirt in the air. A welcome sight, and Ballon can't thank them enough. Not only for the vigilance and the willingness, but just the character. Will you ever go on a trip like this again? So I mentioned I have a girlfriend. <laughs> and you might imagine that I had to make a promise not to do this. And again, I'll do it again, but not alone. That was the problem. What an ordeal. Well, detectives visited Bilan in the hospital, even bringing him some of his favorite pizza you saw there. So he is planning a little surprise thank you for them in return, but we promised we wouldn't say exactly what it is. So to be continued.